back to Drunk Peers Review Beers. Today we ha we sample a beer from the strange land of Germany. Where? Deutschland? Sprachen Sie dick, Derek. Uh, <laughs> you can take your shot on pronouncing How that. do you, uh... Should I? Westphalenaner. Well, Westphalenaner? West you want me to do the... Westphalenaner. Westphalenaner. Yes, that. Yes. Wait, isn't the W pronounced a B? So it's... Wasserwiener. Uh-huh. Yeah. <laughs> Which translates yeah. to Miss Pilsner. Yes, and Miss Pilsner oh. is on the bottle. And what do you know? Barbie! She's, yeah, what do you know? She's blonde hair, blue eyed. Hmm. Is this like Hugh Hefner's favorite hmm. beer? Hmm, that's weird. What, uh, do you, what do you mean? Are you saying that all Germans are blonde hair, blue eyed? No, I'm saying this is a superior German Pilsner. Oh. That was brewed by rules via 1556, which, by the way, was shortly after Columbus sailed the ocean. Wait, Wait. this has been brewed since 1556? Excuse me, I, I got that wrong. It's 1516. Mm. Produced strictly according to the Can German... Can with that, American beers? Yes, but we do it better like everything. Uh, produced strictly according to German purity law of 1516. So I was off by a few years. It's actually 1516. I apologize to the German purity law. From people, the people of 1513? Yep. But guess what Americans said? Screw purity laws. Peter Dunn. I think our faces are turning purple from drinking so much. <laughs> is that good? Uh, is I that think like, it's bad. Is that like a... I think it's called alcohol poisoning. Yeah. I think that's reverse cirrhosis. From the liver? We're regenerating, we're regenerating our livers. Uh, so, it is 5.1% alcohol by volume. Average. And this one is one pint. Okay. Anything else? It's... It's brewed and bottled by Grafenzu's Joy Bikesy, Braha Wasim, in Marsburg, Germany. And, All right. uh, yeah, I will let you dive into that. So, I don't remember which exact German brewer it was, but, so they don't brew these, when they say that they're from, you know, 1516, they don't brew it mm -hmm. the same way now as they used to. It doesn't sit in a barrel Wait. and age. Then why, how do they pass the purity laws? Right, mm -hmm. no, so here's the thing though, they still do that with a certain percentage of the beer that they make. So is this and they it? literally go down and they do like monthly taste tests to make sure that the the new way of brewing the beer still tastes just like the old way of doing it. That doesn't sound official at all. It is. That sounds half assed And I'm talking, these barrels are not like a barrel. These are like mm -hmm. gigantic drums that you could you could fall in and drown easily, your entire family. That's like having Larry the Cable Guy as a Navy SEAL. What are you talking about right now? It, it doesn't sound legit. It doesn't sound official. I saw it on a documentary. The Germans know okay. what they're doing. The good. only reason that you can claim that you've been brewing your beer from 15 whatever is because you were a brewery back then and you did it a certain way. Well, they you don't think... brew it the same way anymore, but they make a taste the same as the old world style. You think Laf Wolfheisen is was back then? That's what they say. I mean, I haven't Googled it. Have you? Can I ask you a are question? Are you skeptical right now? Are you skeptical hip can, can I ask you a question? Yeah. Where you bought this, can you also buy porn? Well, of course. Where else do you get German beer? Okay. <laughs> what does that have to do with anything? Let's let's dig in. You trying to tell me they didn't get this from Germany? I think they got a direct link. Porn or me? This dude named Adolf. Gives them their shit. Is he related to Adolf Coors? Yes. All good Adolf's made beer. The bad ones, we won't talk about. Speaking of Coors, it has a very... It looks like It Coors. looks a lot like Coors and PBR, which we tried previously. Chick is hot. I mean, she looks, looks like Barbie. Looks a lot like my wife. Looks like every Playboy playmate you've ever seen. So again, 
It smells like a lager. Pilsner. It smells like a lager. Seats are on, I guess. I don't know. It smell. Yeah, it does. It smells a lot like your other light beers. It really does. Kind of got that floral scent. Um, I don't know. It doesn't really stand out. You taste it first. What are you doing? Watching the bubbles. Dust bubbles. Shows you how much carbonation is in there. Dust boot. You see? You see how it does the tornado thing? Did you even take science class in sixth grade? Probably not. I didn't pay attention. I took it four times. I was, try, I I was trying to figure out English. Ooh. I was trying to figure out English with Mrs. That, Lee. Speaking of English, that tastes like old English. Okay, just right off the bat, is it better than PBR? No. Marketing. What's that kind of candy taste at the end? There's a really crappy candy that. Miss Pilsner. That's what it's called. Miss Pilsner. You suck. You're garbage. You sound good. What is that at the end? I can't think of it. It's got my mind in a pretzel. <sighs> Stone Cold Steve Austin fucking... It's not... What is that? Swigability? Four. Yeesh. That burnt... My swigability, like so, it's not swigalicious. Yeah. Uh, wow. Uh, that burnt like walking barefoot in the desert with your balls out, and they get sunburned, and then someone comes along and sack taps you. That's what that burnt like. I don't even know what's going on here. I want to reevaluate my life after drinking this. You I do? Mean, seriously. In a good way or a bad way? In a bad way. What would you give this flavor rating graded on a curve of German beers you've had? Uh, it's not many. Umbex? Is Bex even German? It's not Spanish. It's... Bex is Spanish. Uh, Spanish. So, on a scale of 1 to 10, This is down in the Coors. This is like 4.2. I'm going to go with 3.7 for me. Uh, I think the only reason why I'm going to finish this is because of just my life being in a shithole. I guess you're in a dark place. You got dark. So it didn't get dark until I drank this, though. I was pretty good pretending to just check the swig ability when I chugged it. Mm hmm. The chug ability, if you will, the ability to just pour it in. Switch it up, mommy. No. Swig uh, ability, it it's like a. Mm, for me, it's like a six point. It burnt. Nine. It burnt to chug. The six point nine. Chug, 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 chug. Get it. Yeah, I guess. It's six. I get you. Um, <laughs> marketing. I, you know, I, you put a hot chick on there, it's not bad, okay? I don't, mean to, object, on. I don't mean to objectify women, but... You kind of are, though, sir. She's not bad looking. For 5.1% alcohol, I would be, you'd be tough to find me drinking this beer ever again. Yeah, I mean, if you threw out like a 10%er or a 9%er, I mean... Then I'm feeling it. Then it's going to go up. It's going to go... <sighs> but at least getting the job done. The, the price is right, Bob. The fact that I have to drink three of those to get wasty pants. Uh, uh, it's like bringing a knife to a gunfight. It just doesn't work. It doesn't. That's how you get stabbed. Did I get that wrong? That's what you meant, right? What is that? Gross. That's it's like gross. It has like a laffy taffy end to, ending to it. Yeah, like it's laughing at the fact that your tongue is like... <sighs> It's laughing at me right now. I can hear it giggling at me drinking. It's yeah. like, why are you doing this? It's her, man. She's got you. It's she, nice. She does. Those like, pearlescent blue eyes. I 
I don't even know right now. I am what do you rate lost you, in space. So what do you rate the marketing? The marketing? I'm gonna. It's gonna get. It's gonna get weird quickly. Okay. Eight point nine. Nice. Yeah, I'm gonna go with you. I'm gonna say about an eight point five. Uh, it jumped off the shelf to me. That's why I bought it. I love the red. I love the gold. And love the, the obviously uh, the focal point right the, in this V area. I love the uh, I'm a European soccer team badge that they put on there. Or Ferrari. Or Ferrari La Ferrar. La Ferrar. That's how they pronounce it over there. That is. I'm making the pizza. Ms. Pilsner. What's up? What's up? She could make my pizza if I wasn't married. Definitely going to keep the bottle, but... It'll make... Yeah, it's going to be a great bottle. Um, you know what? You'll see it... You know what? This would be great. future point. videos next to the Book of Mormon. You know what would make... <laughs> You know what it'd make what? It'd make a great beer. You know, go to the graveyard and pour one out for your homies. Uh -huh. <laughs> you got the bottle, but your homie got a shit beer. Yeah. I mean. All the homies drink old E. And that's what this tastes like. You know, I might. We're going to have to do. A, I say we do drink this one more time. Let's do this versus old English. You I hate your taste, but I do will accept this challenge. If you want to like smell like the beer you drank the next day, then you'll accept this challenge. That was bad. <laughs> it just wasn't good. No. You can do better, Germany. You can, and I'm sure you have. We'll yeah. find it. Unbex. We're making our way around the world. Yeah. Rolling from rock. My, from my man cave. Yes. AKA his mom's basement. Let's yeah. Be honest. Yeah. We keep talking about the mom's basement. Yeah. Uh, it's actually the attic, so... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Shut up, Mom! <laughs> Mom, next beer! <laughs> Gosh, that was not... That was surprisingly bad. It was... I didn't think it was going to be necessarily great, but I didn't think it was going to be, like, Coors Light bad. It was at least Coors Light or bad. Or Coors Original bad. It was definitely Coors Original bad. 